All right, Nathan, we've got two very off-road worthy trucks. The Raptor is obviously very off-road worthy and so is the Frontier Pro 4X, but which one's better? In the snow? Yeah. Mine. No way, this one's better. More ground clearance, bigger tires. No, no, no. The problem is, is that yours is kind of like a big cushion being pushed through the snow. Mine is like a needle just shooting right through the snow. It's kind of like the difference between a 22 caliber bullet and a nine millimeter when you're penetrating things. All right, I have to agree with you, Nathan. This is a 50 caliber, that's a 22. Oh, come on, That's a, uh, don't, don't minimize my truck. This is a really good little truck off-road. All right, so how are we gonna prove this? Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna create two snow banks, and the one that's more efficient for busting through it is the better truck in snow. All right, no rocks in the snow bank. Oh, really? No trees. <laughs> Dude, I wasn't, I, I, was, I was thinking, okay. All right, let's do it. Finishing touches on Roman's great wall. All right, it's not so great. It's only about three feet tall. But you know what? We're having fun out here in the Colorado snow, and I think this will be a challenge that Nathan will enjoy taking on. This is reminiscent of Fort Bradley with a just a little bit of Fort Robertson, California. I'm modeling it after both types of security complexes that are there, and on top of that, some solid snow for the Raptor. All right, Nathan, I think we managed to prove two things. We suck at building walls. Yes, and slow-mo is way cool. It is awesome, but you know what, guys? We had snow, we had trucks, we wanted to have some fun. Yeah, give us a break on those comments. We're out here just playing in the Colorado snow. As always, this is Roman. And Nathan. Saying thanks for watching. Remember, check out the Fast Lane Truck, tfltruck.com, for all trucks all the time. Damn straight.